So, in today's video, I want to share with you a recent purchase I made through Key Australia. I have them right here. Um, a couple of weeks ago, Key ran a buy one get one free offer across their sunglasses and their blue light glasses. So I made two purchases and ended up with four pairs of glasses. So this is going to be a Key Australia haul or mini haul. Does four items count as a haul? Anyway, so first up, if you've seen my blue light uh, glass test video are these blue light blocking glasses and they are the model all nighter they're a little bit grubby because I keep putting my hands on them but I love them I love the shape I love how stylish they are especially with my hair up like this it makes it like it really pulls the look together they're really incredibly well made I can understand where the pricing comes from with key especially when I compare it to the quality of the blue light ones that I bought from Amazon well both of the other pairs that I bought were perf they worked perfect as blue light blockers this particular style feels a lot more expensive and granted it is but it just feels that bit more as high end maybe you would say so here's the blue light blocking glasses and the model on this is the all nighter and these were about 55 euro I will have the links and the prices for everything listed below and they came in this case with a cleansing cloth for the for the lenses ones ones that I got were I'm going to separate them out to the uh, into the packages that I actually got them in so at the same time as those blue light glasses I got another pair that were the after hours range in the tortoise, in the tortoise brown. So here are the sunglasses, you can see. Here they are on they're not a they're a very big sunglass but they're not huge they don't totally take away from your face I have quite a big face so I like to have sunglasses cover a good portion of them so but the one thing that I will say about this is really great is it's very difficult for me to find sunglasses that come down low like this but don't touch off my cheeks so you no risk of getting your makeup all over the lenses you will of course have some makeup come off on the bridge of your nose but I don't know how to stop that I will continue to try though so these are the after hours in the tortoise brown shade it will be linked below again these were about 50 55 euro but I'll let you know down in the description box below and these ones came in a different case they came with this kind of case but it didn't inc they didn't include a, a lens cleaner a lens cloth but that's fine I have a few of them now. another point that I like to make about sunglasses is and this is more personal preference really for me I have quite a gap between my lash line and where my eyebrow is I don't love it when my eyebrows are visible above sunglasses I know that's really funny I don't mind it so much with my with my reading glasses or my prescription glasses or even the blue light blocking glasses but something to do with the sunglasses I just like them to have um, a full cover effect here is the black pair that I got you can see They have the classic uh, key logo on them on this side and then it's on 
either it's on either arm it's on both arms rather this particular one is the icy with the fade so you can see it's darker at the top and then it fades to a much lighter lens at the bottom again the same with these which is really fantastic is they're big but they don't touch off your cheeks so there's no you're not running a risk of sort of your your makeup going because you've got glasses on or if you keep doing this which is something that i do and then when you take your glasses off all your makeup is gone from under your eyes that doesn't happen but you will see these are actually really really lovely and very much the i guess the celebrity movie star style but i love a black sunglass and um, while at the time I was buying these, I didn't notice the the gradient on the lens. But I actually really love it. It gives it a little bit of dimension because they're just they're just plain black. And finally, these I think are my favorite, and these are the the Nusa. And again, these are kind of a tortoise print but in brown and they have kind of a cat eye effect so it comes up in a little point up here you can see it I gotta hide my face as so I'm learning with my camera that if I hide my face it will focus on the thing that I wanted to focus on and then key there and again key is on written on both sides so these ones are a little bit smaller than the other ones, but I love the shape. Then granted, the Icy and the After Hours, they're very much in the same shape. But when I bought, was buying the Icy, I seen this pair and I thought it would be really, really great to have something that's that little bit different in shape. I give it a little bit of... Um, a difference say for if I have my hair down which by the way it's finally getting cut next week yay um so we have these now granted we haven't had the best weather since I've been buying these uh but hey they're really good sunglasses they're extremely well made and for the price point that I got them at, they were buy one, get one free. So it kind of worked out as them being half price each pair. So they kind of put it on par with what you might pay for sunglasses in River Island. Um, and that tends to be where I go for sunglasses because I really love their style. They're better made than buying in the likes of Pennies or Primark rather um or dun stores even yeah they're more expensive but i think in general my river island pair that i got three years ago is still going strong so you can't you can't go wrong and as my mom always said you get what you pay for so the way the, these glasses come comes in this size box it comes in this size box with the key logo all over the inside so you can't miss it this size box held two held um two pairs of sunglasses and then they had like a bubble wrap thing on top of it fantastic cannot recommend this brand enough i can't wait till we're able to go out and about even if it's october I will still be wearing them. Of course, I think what I'm going to do is I'm obviously not going to be wearing them all the time and it's great to have some nice sunglasses on rotation. So I'm really looking forward to actually getting to wear them. They're fantastic, phenomenal value for what they are. And now that I've seen the value of them, I won't hesitate to pay 50, 60 euro for a full for um, a full price pair going forward so I really like a lot of their styles a lot of the I guess more funky more trendy ones aren't really my cup of tea because I like to pick something that's a little bit more classic and long-lasting 
in from that sense and i myself i'm not a i don't follow trends particularly um if there's one that i like i might i might have a moment with it but in general i don't follow trends so having glasses that maybe have the the mirror effect on them or the the pink mirror effect or whatever color that's there it's not really my style so i don't so that they're not the ones that i'm going to go for but i will most definitely be keeping my eye on that website come next summer to see if they have any new styles or new colors even to add to my collection which i'm very happy that i've started sunglasses is something that i have been always back and forth about paying a lot of money for but i've always wanted a good pair and now i have three so that's great good going i've seen some really lovely ones on a couple of vloggers on youtube but i think they are potentially from older collections on key or maybe they weren't even available here because they were american vloggers um so there's that but i am going to obviously going to keep going back and forth um i was notified about the buy one get one free offer by email so maybe if you want to see if um if that offer came up for you again maybe go onto their website and sign up for their emails i would be interested to see come black friday and cyber monday if they will bring any bring that kind of offer back again because i will likely jump on that again there are some really lovely styles that particular icy one i would like it with a non-gradient lens and in a brown color i don't know why i go for brown actually i love black all the time but but two pairs of those sunglasses are brown and the blue light blockers are brown too but the icy frame i would love it in a brown with a non-gradient lens or something very similar so i will be going back um in like i said probably around black friday so in november sometime to see if they have them for summer, spring, summer next year. That's it. So that was my Key Australia haul. I will leave links to the styles that I bought in the description box below along with the price that I paid. Remember that these were bought on buy one get one free. I did pay for them with my own money and uh, but there was an offer on when I bought them. So that's all for now and until next time, bye.